Hello everyone, welcome to a foreign farming in the Philippines. Well, LBC is here, and uh, this I believe is our deep fryer. It was it was delivered I think last Friday, but we weren't here or Saturday, one or the other. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, it's four thousand five hundred pesos delivered. Can you uh, handle that, lady? Yeah. Okay. Oh God, it's pretty big. <laughs> I can carry one hand only, like this. All right. Well, I'm gonna go save my lunch. <laughs> we'll open this up. We'll open this up after I eat. A what? Where are we going to put this hand? Just put it on the table with the, where the washer thing is. It's like one kilo. It's like one kilo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to open it up. See what we got in there. It said fragile. Yeah, at least they marked it fragile. Don't open. More bubble wrap for red red. See? Really <coughs> well. With bubble wrap. Okay. Hopefully this will uh, be as advertised. Because just our luck, the ice maker doesn't work anymore. It worked for like three days. It made, we weren't running it continuously. We got about 10 pounds of ice out of it and now it won't make ice anymore. I'm gonna take it apart and see if there's something wrong. It's doing everything except getting cold. All the automatic controls and it work. It's the... It said that the driveway is blocked. The, it's taking the water in, it's holding it, uh, but it's just not making ice cubes. Put in the fridge. Wait, wait, Oh, you got it upside down? Yeah. It's from China. Yeah, it's from China. Everything's from China these days. That's one of the pitfalls of having to order online, but there's no there's no restaurant supply place handy here. So we just got to take our take our risks. Uh oh, it's English. I can see power light, hot light. Well, the things are actually, a lot of it's actually in English. That's pretty dang amazing. Do you want some help, love? Yeah. All right. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Okay. Okay. What is the styrofoam taped on the bottom? Mm. Oh, Red's gonna have lots of fun. I don't want to do Red. So this is it. All right, this is a double unit. And well, it has instructions which are in what? English. English, wow. That is amazing. Electric fryer, use, man use your manual, read the product before use. You see? Wow. English. 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 Well, this seems all here so far. Lift this out, love.
pull. Now each one of these are uh, 2,500 watts each side. Wait, so wait, 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 wait. this does pull some electricity. I was thinking uh, one side for fries and uh, the other side for uh, fish. This is an interesting plug. Mini bolt. 230. 250. And the voltage is right. What are you doing, man? I was trying to get that up through there. Yeah, like Lady. this? Yeah, like that. Wait a minute. Mm-hmm. Mmm. You remove. What is this? That's the handle. Um. Of the basket. Hmm. All right. Well, we've got it assembled, and that was uh, a little bit of giggling, uh, but we got it put together. So this is how it would be if you're just waiting to cook something. Just leave these on top because this not much, but it does add a little bit of uh, insulated value, so you can. It's easier to keep your oil hot. This little removable tray. Fill it up with whatever you're going to fry. And drop it in. Now we're kind of on the fence as to whether this little guard here goes on the bottom. I think it does. I think it, it's to insulate the bottom of the pan from the heating element. So this would go right on top. I would assume there's not uh, there's not two racks. Well, yeah, I guess there is, but. Um, so I guess this would be your your uh, your draining rack, and this would be your cooking rack. It's not a lot of uh, cooking area because if these were full of oil, you'd have about an inch. Yeah, about an inch and a half on this end and about three on that one, two and a half. So, I wonder. No, it'll sit there, but that's it. So it's, it's probably looking for a, a expedia, expedient sake. Uh, just leave those on at night to cover your oil and keep uh, critters out and during the day. Just make it work. It's functional. So I've got it plugged in. Uh, I'm not going to make both of these uh, come on at the same time because it is it is 2,500 watts per side. And it's over 20 amps. But I did plug it in. If I can get out of the way here. The heating element does come on on both sides. It's got little markings here 
for temperatures for whatever you want to fry french fries, chicken wings, chicken legs, uh, fish, steak, whatever. So, uh, 4,700 pesos. I'm fairly pleased with it. It's really thin gauge. It's not like what you would. Uh, it's not like what you expect in the West for restaurant restaurant quality, but um, we're not in the West, so it's good enough. I'm sure it'll work. I'm not going to like the power bill, but in the mall you can't have gas operated appliances or cookers, fryers, grills, whatever. So it is what it is. And I think each side holds about, a, uh, I think it's five liter each side. So it's about a gallon and a half of oil capacity on each side. And uh, that's important because uh, these are mainly going to be cooking french fries. And if you put a couple order of orders of fries in a small unit, um, it takes them an extra long time to cook and they just don't, they just don't cook right. But with a large oil capacity like this, your oil won't cool, cool down that much and when you put your fries in, and it just works that much better. So, there it is. Thank you everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.